air tank low. Now that might be a problem for me. Probably means mine's about to be low too. We just gotta get up here, pop, pop it on the old, uh, you know. Yeah. How do we do this again? You just like take it off and then stick it on there for a second and then oh, yeah, stick okay. it back in. Well. Doesn't seem to be working for me. <laughs> hey, if uh, Kerbal Space Program 2 has multiplayer, you want to play? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, wish it was more than building. I played it once and I was it was fine. It's a really good game, but yeah, it's very dumb. It's just so hard. Oh, I'm it's no, nah, it's game. easy. No, nah, 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 you're no, no way. No, nah, I'm too dumb for that game. No, 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 no. Yeah, we started a new save. It's supposed to be out in like February, I think, in early access. I can't figure out how to fill my oxygen tank. Oh, God. All right. Maybe we shouldn't play Kerbal Space Program. I'm have just you, kidding, man. Have you filled your oxygen yet? No. Oh, okay. I think we have to take this out. Oh, you might be right. Let me get a wrench out here. Hope the storm doesn't come. Yes, sir. Um, there we go. Now I think we can do it. Yeah. Stick it on that yellow part. There you go. Now I'm going to nice put job. this somewhere where it might not blow away. Like right here. As long as the wind doesn't blow that direction. One direction. Is there a mount for it? It feels yeah, like. Yeah, there is. Yeah. That seems like a good investment. Yeah. I mean, like. I, I agree with you. I. Take a look. There just aren't that many other ways to get oxygen right now. So. Basic shoots. I don't see them out, but I'm bad, so... Um, it might not be in... Container mount? It doesn't go on a container mount, does it? Container mount. No, that's the one we built already, I think. Yeah, I wonder if it can go on there, though. Anyway. Maybe it's the, in the, this one. No. Uh, there's another crafting station we don't have yet. It might be in that one. It's called the uh, Bender, the Tube Bender or something. Oh! Like bending tubes. Uh, what? How's our situation with uh, respect to materials? Uh, pretty good. I was going to go mining maybe when the sun comes up. We need coal again. Okay. We also need volatiles. So for one of the next things we need, we need steel. And when we do that, I'm going to show it's kind of dumb. Yeah, it's like one of those things where you could never know how to do it without looking at a video or whatever. So I'm going to show you how to do that. But we need, so yeah, we need volatiles and we need more coal. Okay. We I mean, probably need a little bit of everything. I was going to wait till the sun comes up, but where the heck is the sun? We're going to have a problem it's eventually also about drinking water. That's going to be a problem. True. There are water... There's a water canister, but we need... You know. Do we have a water canister? Well, yeah. It's, it's in... It came with the boat, but like... like canister oh yeah we need to fill it i think somehow you know yeah we can make stuff to make water but i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it in time before we die 
All right. There it is, the sun. Wowie! I'm out of here. I'm stuck. Got him. That's pretty unhelpful right now. Gold could be good in a minute. Oh, cobalt, okay. Okay. Maybe we can make a... Something to do with science. I think we should make lollipops out of it. Okay. What do you think it tastes like? Uh, burning. <laughs> okay. I feel like it probably tastes like if you stick your tongue in an electrical socket. Hmm. I haven't tried that yet. Oh. That's a good thought, Mecham. You know, I bet a lot of things taste like burning. And then there's some things that don't, and those are the ones you gotta watch out for, you know? Yeah. I'm just gonna start putting out everything, just licking everything. Okay. You remember that time we went to the bean and you wouldn't let me lick it? Yeah. Sorry about that. Dude, I saw somebody post a picture of licking the bean on the internet and I lost my mind. Really? It was like, that could have been me. Yeah. Yeah, that could have been you. Well, I might have saved your life, though. Yeah, maybe. This is before COVID, though, so I probably would have been fine. <laughs> okay. Very good, very good. Oh, oxide. That's probably something to get. Yeah, it just goes away though. It just melts. Yeah, just don't hold it. Yeah, that's the problem. Keep it in your tool belt forever. Does it melt if you put it in a locker? Well, yes. Uh, that's why I put it in the container. I don't know if that makes a difference, but like, it is contained. You would need an ice box. The card, hello? Dude, that's that's, that's exactly the correct way to play the game. Minus 150 degrees Celsius. Whoops. <laughs> Had the opposite problem. Wonder what happens. Uranium. Yes. I'm gonna leave that in the ground for now. We're only going to be alive for another 15 minutes, so I don't think we can get cancer in that time. 15 minutes? Is there a timer on our... Are we dead? I don't know. Okay. I'm just assuming.
Some of the best moments I've ever had in Kerbal were uh, get, uh, doing rescue missions and not having enough, uh, not having enough uh, fuel left to get one Kerbal to the other ship. Or like to sync up the ships properly. So I did like a like a two kilometer EVA to to get one of my Kerbals to uh out of out of his uh dead dead ship into a new one. In like low Kerbin orbit. He's just like flying just it, it's the most insane, exhilarating, hilarious thing. No, you really, you just have to know, like, you just have to know very basic orbital mechanics. It's it's a lot easier than you think. There's, like, one concept that you need to wrap your head around, and then it all makes sense. The concept is basically gravity is always happening. Gravity is always happening, and you're always moving. Yeah, the EVA stuff can be really frustrating, but when you get it to work, it's really rewarding. Once you once you like learn how or basic orbital mechanics work, it's really frustrating to watch any movies that have space in them. But it's okay. I'm up to 88 coal. Oh, that's really good. I'm up to 60, 70. Oh, nice. Losing, losing the coal race. Are you though? It feels like we're it's we're winning. Dark, so just FYI. Okay. Yeah, it seems like we're winning. I agree. Oh, you said we need volatiles, right? Yeah, it's not an immediate. I we can get it later if you want. I was gonna start making steel, so we can make batteries. But uh, I'm gonna focus on trying to get water. I think for now. What do we do with our waste tanks? I forget. You just open it. Just yep, poop it out. Where do I open it? You press, you just click on it and then hit open in the bottom. It just like vents it into the. Okay, neat. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I, I now understand your project over here. <laughs> Already out of space. Oh God.
Oh, silver ore. Where do we get that? It looks like all of the oxide I put in this crate evaporated. You're lucky. Yeah. Why do you suppose we have a credit card? Uh, maybe I was thinking about that. I was thinking at first I was like, probably we can just invoice each other for stupid stuff for, you know, immersion purposes. And then I was like, maybe we're going to be able to sell stuff and vendor things. Like Astroneer has a trading, off-world trading thing. You send a little rocket up. I wonder oh. if there's something like that in this game. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, someone says traders. Okay. Let's trade them all of our uranium. Yes. I'm putting the spray paint in here too. Okay, I'm excited to figure out what to, to, how to do that. I want to spray everything. It looks like you just spray it if you want. Maybe we can trade it. <laughs> Turns out that the spray paint was the most valuable commodity we brought with us to the planet. Hey, John. This game makes you want to have kids? Wait, Kerbal does or this game? Sorry about this. What's my secret cap? Not doing that well with the old uh, with the water. Yeah, that bottle is four percent zero. Yeah, uh, zero. This might be the last one. Wait, you had wait wait wait. There, there were you two go. bottles. Okay, perfect. Uh, yeah, I that's for I'm you. Gonna... Yeah. Hey, emo. Okay. <laughs> Listen, I'm working on it. Will I work on it fast enough? Probably not. We'll find out. What do I need to do to assist in this? Um, that's a good question. I'm not 100% sure. I'm making this thing. Okay. It's taking so long. Jeez. It makes the ice crusher. Okay. I don't remember exactly what we hey, need. Hey, uh, I don't know if we need certain Same to you. Nice certain to see you. Materials. Do you work? We, we, have, we seem to have a lot of everything, actually. I don't know if there's a way to get this liquid. Look at this liquid canister. Can we somehow... Yeah. There must be a way to do that, right? It seems like this is supposed to be for like a water fountain type of thing. Maybe this liquid canister can attach to the water bottle filler. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing it's something like that. Maybe I'll try to make that first just to see if that will hook up. Okay. Holy cow, there's so much stuff. Wait, what's Harvey? What's Harvey? I don't know. There's a, something called Kit Harvey. Dude, I'm so mad. I just... Uh... Are we out of power? We ran out of power at like 95% and it has to restart now. No. Yeah. I put a bigger battery in there. That sucks. 
Uh, well, GG. GG. So much for the water. Can't we just drink this? What is this? Yeah, just lick the ice. Exactly. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching my video. If you enjoyed, feel free to hit the like or subscribe button. But this is Space America, and you can do what you want. Come say hi, twitch.tv slash read. I'm on most afternoons and evenings, and I'd like to see you there.